It's hard to imagine that eggs have become a luxury item on Russian dining tables. Eggs are in short supply, prices have risen significantly, and many Russians are shouting that they can't afford eggs. Russia has vast territory and abundant resources, and is also a major exporter of agricultural products, oil, and natural gas. How could it be trapped by a small egg? The lack of eggs and the sharp rise in egg prices have become a major problem that troubles Putin. He talked about the egg issue three times within a month, which is rare. On January 11, Russian news network reported that Russian President Putin once again responded to the significant increase in egg prices in Russia during a meeting with entrepreneurs in Khabarovsk on January 10, he said. The increase in egg prices is because we didn't grasp the direction in a timely manner. Our production hasn't decreased, income has increased, and people are starting to buy more eggs and chicken, but they haven't considered opening up imports in a timely manner prosperity, soaring prices. Putin gave his opinion on the reasons for the significant increase in egg prices in Russia. Firstly, the Russian government did not timely grasp the direction of the increase in egg prices. 2. Russia's egg production has not decreased. 3. Russians have seen an increase in income and consumption buying more eggs has led to a severe shortage of eggs. 4. The Russian government did not open up imports in a timely manner in the face of egg shortages, and only imported eggs from abroad after the problem became severe. This is Putin's third response to the egg issue within a month, indicating that the egg issue has become a major concern for him and the Russian government. On December 14 last year, Putin held his annual press conference and live streaming connection event in Moscow, answering 67 questions. One of the questions was that a retired Russian lady complained to him that eggs were too expensive to afford. The retired Russian lady said to Putin during a call, The price of eggs has risen from 180 rubles to 220 rubles. When has such a price happened? Per retirees, we don't have a million ruble retirement pension. We hope you can help us. After a brief cough, Putin said, I regret and apologize for this. The increase in egg prices is a dereliction of government duty. I just had a conversation with the Minister of Agriculture. I guarantee that this situation will improve in the near future. Putin also explained the reason for the surge in eggs. Firstly, the demand for eggs in the market has increased, but production has not increased. Secondly, the import of eggs was not opened in a timely manner. The second time Putin talked about the Russian egg issue was on December 25th last year, at a meeting of the Council of the Eurasian Economic Commission, when Belarusian President Lukashenko claimed that Belarus had achieved a high level of food self-sufficiency. Lukashenko said, Belarus meets people's needs including grains, pork, poultry, milk, vegetables, and vegetable oil. Then, he turned his head to Putin and continued, and the demand for eggs and other foods. After listening, Putin jokingly said to Lukashenko, Then give us some too, don't be too stingy. Last year, Russia experienced a shortage of eggs. In the second half of the year, the shortage intensified and evolved into an egg shortage crisis, leading to a surge in egg prices. According to data from the National Bureau of Statistics of the Russian Federation, the price of eggs in November 2023 increased by 15.07% compared to October, and by 36.54% compared to the beginning of the year. The price of eggs for the whole year increased by 42.4% and the price of eggs in Crimea controlled by Russia skyrocketed by 94%. After the retired Russian lady complained to Putin during a live broadcast that she couldn't afford eggs, the Russian Ministry of Economic Development announced that from January 1st to June 30th, 2024, Russia will import 1.2 billion eggs duty-free to alleviate egg shortages and curb price spikes. Russian Agriculture Minister Petrochev said that it is expected that the recent duty-free import of eggs from Azerbaijan and Turkey will curb the price fluctuation of eggs. 
The Russian news network reported on January 9 that the second batch of eggs imported from Turkey was 1936 tons, 316,800 eggs. On January 5, they entered Russia through the Dagestan Yarag Kazmarial checkpoint. On January 3, the first batch of eggs exported from Turkey to Russia arrived in Russia on January 3, with a quantity of 1936 tons, 316,800 eggs. Ibrahim Afayan, chairman of the Turkey Egg Producers Alliance, said that Turkey was ready to supply Russia with the eggs needed by the recipient in the next six months. In addition to Turkey, Azerbaijan also exported a large number of eggs to Russia. The first 36 tons of eggs arrived in Russia on December 19, 2023. The second batch of 18 tons, 306,000 pieces, of eggs entered Russia on December 21st last year through the Dagestalag Kazmaria port. The quantity of the third batch of eggs delivered by Azerbaijan to Russia is 18 tons, 306,000. On January 10, TASS reported that from January 1st to 9th, 2024, the number of eggs exported by Belarus to Russia almost doubled compared to the same period last year, reaching 11.7 million. In less than a month, Turkey, Azerbaijan and Belarus have exported nearly 200 tons of eggs to Russia, which has alleviated the egg shortage crisis in Russia to some extent. The Russian Ministry of Agriculture stated at the end of last year that with an increase in domestic egg production and the supply of duty-free eggs from friendly countries, egg prices are expected to stabilize after the new year. However, reality is more realistic than ideal, and Russia has yet to solve the problems of egg shortage and high prices. According to official data released by Russia, the overall inflation rate announced in November last year was relatively controllable at 7.5%. However, the increase in egg prices in Russia is several times that of the overall inflation rate, and eggs have become one of the most expensive foods in Russia. On January 10, when Putin met with entrepreneurs in Khabarovsk, he talked about the egg issue for the third time in a month. Behind this was actually Putin's concern about Russia's egg crisis, as it would affect his vote share in the presidential election held in March, even though he was likely to win.